¡Feliz cumpleaños a ti! Honestly, with all the things that I had to do, it was pretty much impossible to me to do it. Pretty much. I could have done it, but just I didn't have the time to edit because I'm the one who edits these videos. Anyhow, um, basically at one of our restaurants, they're coming. It's called the Peruvian Restaurant Guide. Um, they actually promote Peruvian restaurants in all over the world. They had started first in United States and they they just do an incredible artistic job. And the people who started this project, actually um, they work hand in hand with Virgilio Martinez from Central. So if you're a foodie, you may, oops, sorry. Another notification. If you're a foodie, you may know because Central is one of the best restaurants in the world and is located in Peru, as well as Casa Moreira. So again, if you're a foodie and you're into these, the best of the best in the world, then you know which restaurants I'm talking about. So it is quite exciting to host them, to be working with them for our new projects. And uh, yeah, so I'm heading right now to the hotel where they are staying at and picking them up. Yesterday they were actually here today, arrived in the early afternoon. We did some filming, some talking, some chat. I mean, we had a great time conversation. I, I wish they live closer to us so we can just chat you know our way out they they are just so much fun they are incredible amazing and i'm just i mean so stoked to have such artists um working with us right now i'm like i'm, I'm just beyond myself so i'm running a little bit late <laughs> i did my makeup super fast and now we gotta go to pick them up and i will show you perhaps some behind the scenes so you can see a little bit of my life because youtube is not my full-time job it's not um yeah, my full time job is something completely different. And all these videos and, this, and you know, footage, images, and all of that, they will be actually um, promoted by Prom Peru, which promotes Peru in different countries, obviously. You know, it's kind of like a, an extension of the government in terms of, again, promoting Peru, their, in, our ingredients, our tourism, our gastronomy, etc. Right, um, and also these videos will be seen in my country, Peru. So that makes me even more excited because I love Peru as much as I love United States too. Because literally, I have lived um, 21 years in Peru and almost 23 years here in the United States. Can you believe that? So this is also home for me. Anyhow, let's get going. <laughs> There are times I can remember with family and friends The light of Christmas radiates Light of my memories, the magic of love We make time, but why does it change with the seasons? And why can't we just hold on? Singing goodwill to all 
I have no idea how this vlog is going. I I had the most amazing December month. It is my birthday month and not only that, I mean we celebrate the holidays. It was also my daughter's, well my oldest daughter's birthday month, my sister's. <laughs> so we had such an incredible time, the entire family together. And so we did a lot of things, as you can tell I did a lot of, like I went a lot to do some shopping, some for me, some just because and yes I got something from Chanel I'm gonna unbox it in a second I just want to wrap up this vlog saying that I think I already said it many times happy new year to all of you I wish that all your dreams everything that you are putting yourself into just becomes a reality it becomes the best year of your life and yeah a lot of you had asked me if i'm gonna do some sort of like video of resolutions and whatnot i may do it i'm thinking about wish list perhaps goals let me know if you're interested about that because yeah there are some things that i want a change in my life in this 2024 um one of them is not letting me is that the heavy amount of releases from Chanel Dior just hit me so hard the second day of January that literally I haven't had the chance to actually record any of my wish lists, my goals, etc. So I have here a little bit of a haul, like an accumulated haul. I know you have already watched my Dior haul unboxing that I did a couple days ago. I'm actually wearing one of the lipsticks sticks i think it is let me tell you 429 rose blues oh my gosh these lipsticks from dior are a lot better to what they used to be before one thing that i love is that the scent is not as prominent as before too i really enjoy these lipsticks way way better both in the velvet and satin finishes i will have my review video hopefully already up on my channel or otherwise it will be you know within the next couple of days another thing that i pick up from dior is one of the new shades of lip maximizers this one it is in I think frosted pink and i also picked up another shade 067 i think it's shimmer gold I will be leaving as per usual all the details in the description box below this one is very frosty i'm actually gonna put it right now i think it will go really well with my entire outfit this cute little cute top is actually from target yes it's super cute and i'm so in love it comes in so many different colors i already picked up the green one i wanted also the white one but they didn't have it on my size and they had a very light kind of baby blue super pretty now from dior they sent me from their loyalty program the birthday gift so if you don't know if you shop through dior directly you can sign up for their loyalty program it's completely free there's no annual fee there's nothing of that and as you accumulate points then you receive depending on your tier different gifts but regardless you always receive your birthday gift and this gift of this year it's wonderful it's a miss dior parfum for your hair i know i know and i love this fragrance you know what i have already another fragrance also from dior but you know let's just spray this on the hair mm. light floral very feminine very pretty and then a rose quartz brush this is actually so heavyweight You hear that oh my god i feel the energy from the courts i'm not i'm i'm just saying like you know that that energy that you can only feel when something makes you super happy so i'm i mean like what an excellent and beautiful gift i'm always like so impressed about dior's loyalty program another thing is also the prestige gift so this is the highest level so i got and you know what you actually do not have to purchase anything you can just add it to car as soon as you hit prestige or if it's your birthday gift or whatnot and they will send it to you without like you don't pay any shipping or nothing i mean like this is not only a travel case this has 
Dior brushes. And this is not the first time that I receive one. So <laughs> I'm so excited. I actually use this travel case a lot. And these brushes are really, really nice. Some other products also from Chanel. The eyeshadow quad in Eclat de Nuit. Oh, I lost one of the applicators. Not that it matters. I mean, this one is your classic very deep smoky kind of eyeshadow quad i will be reviewing this baby soon too i also picked up that le beige eyeshadow palette you know how much i love the new eyeshadow palette in cool but i decided to pick up in light and i have seen that it's coming in and out of a stock so as soon as i saw it in a stock i'm like oh, okay you know what let me get it so here you have it this is right up my alley so gorgeous too wow so pretty pinky mauve you know what i may do a little comparisons perhaps on my instagram or on my tiktok so if you are not there yet come and follow me there there are also a couple other eyeshadow palettes from chanel that i have right here this one it is coral treasure so coral treasure this beauty right here this is from the spring collection i cannot wait to try it and also rivage it comes sorry i just trying to hurry up too because i need to go and pick up my youngest daughter it's i'm like closing time so let me show it to you this is gorgeous too a little pop of blue which we're gonna see a lot this 2024 a pop of shade blue a lot of blue and we have seen it already with the dior mimi rose eyeshadow palette which is the one that i'm using right now i just brought it here on my car just for you to see it because again you may have seen already my like very very intense haul from dior i picked up this new blush from tom four in love scene part of the year well it could be taken as the lunar new year or their valentine collection they are re-promoting honeymoon which i already have it looks super pretty but i don't need it this one is a whole new shade let me show it to you look at that super gorgeous gorgeous and i love this type of formulation it's a big kind of formula very creamy but you need a denser kind of brush it can be a synthetic brush that is dense or a natural hair bristle kind of brush and now from sephora i got i place an order <laughs> and i got my little knife i don't even remember what i got well i remember i remember a couple of things that i got here the newest stuff also another package that i'm waiting for is the new hourglass lip liners but let me tell you really quick for what i got from sephora can you guess this is the new mini my dream eyeshadow palette from natasha venona there are four new shades on this mini eyeshadow palette I know it is very simplistic, perhaps very repetitive, but I really enjoy the formula from Natasha Denona. Also, I like that she has given us four new shades. This is a repeated shade from my dream palette, but this looks just stunning. So we need to try this on. Let me know if you want to see a try-on of new makeup and which makeup you want to see on this try-on because I'm excited. I'm excited to try all these out. Also with this eyeshadow palette well i shouldn't say with this because it doesn't come with that you have to buy it separately but my mini dream glow palette love this baby look at that isn't it it's so cute i love the three shades i know some people think it's a little bit gimmicky but i really appreciate that innovation and you know my friends how much i love lip products and makeup by mario just launched his new super satin lipsticks so i picked up one shade and to be honest with you i picked it up because i was actually scrolling on instagram and he had a little story behind this shade bronx baby it's actually the shade that he remembers his sister wearing and therefore i'm like i love my sisters i love my brothers i love my siblings so i know the feeling he even tear up on it and i mean that that got me <laughs> that literally got me 
There's not really a scent. Even, I mean, perhaps just a very faded vanilla scent. But I'm excited to try those. And a product that went viral, I think, during the holiday season. It is the Tarte Maracuya Juicy Lip Plump. And I think the one that got viral is Rosy Copper. So that's the one that I got. Very alike to the formula of the Hourglass, what is it, Volumizing Phantom Lipsticks. I think they are the Phantom ones. I don't remember all these names. But anyhow, that is it. It's kind of like... Um, lip balm so i want to try it i want to try this formulation and i saw that they were at sephora so i thought you know why not and another thing that is coming at sephora that perhaps when i'm uploading this video it's already available it's prada prada beauty prada foundation the eyeshadows the lipsticks everything do not buy <laughs> the lip balm i know if you have watched my words of 2023 you know why is that i mean like totally cringe there but other than that i mean the eyeshadow is beautiful that foundation is also beautiful too the lipsticks are gorgeous as well i'm thinking about getting an eyeshadow that i had been eyeing and now that it's going to be readily available as sephora that makes me super happy there's so many new launches i bought the new tom for vanilla sex perfume oh my gosh that is incredible incredible amazing i love it i know they have reformulated vanilla fatale i think it is but you know what uh, i don't know i may be interested to just smell and see if they have done a better job but anyhow i mean you know we always get so many releases but it makes me super happy when i see them at sephora and also at ulta i mean i have noticed that Ulta have signed contracts with big, big brands. And that actually makes me super happy. Oh, and the fragrance that I was saying that I was using is the new, new look. So this is not the new look 1947. This is the new take of the new look. Oh my gosh, new, new, new. <laughs> From Francis Corjan. So it's, it's second, wow, game changer right here. So... I actually got this little spray and this baby over here and this is just so good. I really enjoy so much, so much this new take because it does have, mm, it's so good, I, I have it all over me. It does have that incense -y kind of note but in a different way. It's a little bit more, a little bit citrusy, a little bit more like clean girl kind of vibe and Talking about Dior, I really love the new lip liners as much as the new and reformulated lipsticks. This is so good, my friends. This is so good. It's non-drying, so if you like to use it just by itself, it's long-lasting. It does fade a little, so it's not the longest-lasting ever, but it's creamy in a way that is moisturizing but it has a grip. So it doesn't move anywhere. It really stays on. What a beautiful formulation i mean like they did an incredible job with their lipstick formulas and the lip liner formulations regarding the new eyeshadows you have to see my reviews and i will be giving you an update too i will say though from the spring collection the eyeshadow i think i brought it here too so i can show it to you because to me this is super 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 important the pink organza i don't know it does fade a lot faster than other formulations and it is a completely different formula i like the color story and it gave me a very sophisticated look and i really love the color story but i don't know if it's the formula or the finishes that i'm not 100 percent convinced the thing that i will say stay away from unless you're snow white <laughs> is this blush i know i saw it online i know it was light pink but not this white it, like it, it, honestly it's lighter than this top right yeah i feel like even lighter than this top i mean i love i love that shade on my top but these on my cheeks huh? no way okay now i got a little gift from parfums de marley i mean i shouldn't say a little gift because we all know parfums de marley their fragrances are incredible so let me show you what they sent me a little note oh my gosh thank you parfums de marley you're so sweet okay i couldn't resist i had it to open look at this it is a beautiful ornament for my christmas tree and i I love gold. I love to decorate with gold. So this is just 
perfect but they also got me don't you love their holiday box oh my gosh this is so sweet from them so sweet look at this they have sent me meliora oh my gosh oh my gosh i'm just so grateful look at this beauty i mean i mean oh my gosh thank you thank you so much to performance the morley and within this gift box they also sent me oh my goodness a scented candle are you kidding me are you i mean like this is insane this is insane let's let me open it i have to smell it i'm all into candles right now it's the winter season it's just a season for candles you know look at the vessel how beautiful is this and they actually sell them so if you're interested oh my gosh i'm all like smell it this smells so good okay burning it tonight this is incredible an intense honey and cinnamon accord contrasted by amber note reminiscence of king louis 15's delights Oh my gosh, this is so good. Okay, friends, do what you came for. What I got in this box. Oh my gosh, another Chanel unboxing. Okay. Goodness me. These, they do have a story. Because I bought them, I think, three times. Yeah, three times. I got first the wrong size then i was sent the wrong size too and then finally the right size arrived and i'm just i mean you know what it is right a pair of shoes but we shoes you want to guess go ahead guess 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 on the comment section below can you guess what it is? can you guess which pair of shoes they are maybe yes maybe not These are, these are going to take you by surprise. This is something that perhaps you will not expect that from me. I mean, you will expect maybe the shade, the color, but not the style. High heels, flats, well, not boots. I got chanel pink sneakers from the 24c collection oh my goodness i look at this aren't they so beautiful oh my gosh now let me tell you something i had to size up these are i'm usually at 37 and a half in chanel i was like oh you know i can stretch them so i took a 37 first completely wrong from me wrong 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 so then i went in boutique and i tried in another color the 37.5 and i still felt that they were a little bit too snug and they were not the color that i wanted which are the pink ones because i'm in my barbie pink era <laughs> so anyhow um i told my essay as soon as you are able to get a hold of you know the pink ones in a 38 and you send them to me and she said yes and then a couple days later she texts me i got them and i said okay perfect so then she sent them to me and they were at 37.5 when we had decided that 38 would be best so i had to return them back <laughs> and then she was able to get me the 38 so thank you thank you so much to my essay you know who you are i don't like to say names because sometimes they are just way too busy and i like to ask for permission and i know my essay she's extremely busy so i don't want to overwhelm her but she is the best she gets me not i shouldn't say everything that i want but she gets me and she takes care of me and she i mean like you expect not only be treated with respect but i'm not like the biggest spender in chanel there are people that really go ham at chanel and yet she you know she, she really makes that impossible possible to get me what i want and so there you have it my friends really cute really beautiful what do you think about these trainers i really love them i know that they are gonna have the white ones more readily available i think that's what i heard so 
those, depending on how I feel with these ones, I may get the white ones too because I'm really getting a lot of wear and tear on my Hermes Day sneakers. I know, I know, I'm just, I shouldn't say that I'm wearing them too much. I mean, I'm enjoying them and that's important. But I would love to have another pair of white sneakers that I can, you know, exchange at times so that way I, you know, I keep equal amount of wear anyhow my friends this makes it for this vlog i hope that you enjoyed it i know that you love when i do haul unboxes inside my car so here you have it <laughs> let me know if you have gotten any of these products and let's just stay in communication if you haven't done so yet go ahead it's completely free subscribe to my channel make sure you ring that post notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads it will be incredible if you can please come and follow me both on my instagram tiktok if you like this video please give it a thumbs up i will be leaving a couple videos at the end of the screen if you are not done watching my content and until the next time i hope you have a beautiful wonderful day bye, -bye.